Hey, it's Mike here, and today we're going to look at 10 amazing vegan body transformations and get some serious inspiration because all the time I'm talking about these studies and not usually putting a face to it. So today we're gonna put some faces to it. While many of these will show a major weight loss or muscle gain, it's not just about how you look and how hot you are. It's also about reversing disease and becoming healthier. So I just wanted to mention that before we get to number one, which is this couple that collectively lost 200 pounds. That was their before picture, and two years after going vegan overnight, here is their after picture. Bam! Look at her arm, now she is ripped, and she lost 125 pounds, and he lost 75 pounds. Very impressive. Her weight loss was so dramatic in particular that it was featured in this magazine. And at this point, I wanna go ahead and mention the broad study that was done in New Zealand, which boasts the title of being the most effective method for weight loss in obese people at six and 12 months without added exercise or calorie restriction. It just used a whole food vegan diet. Okay, on to number two, Victoria Rose. Here is the before and here is the after. I know not the most intense weight loss ever, but does she have a time machine? Her and her boyfriend just watched the documentary Earthlings and then thankfully switched to a more healthy vegan diet and quote, Soon all the ailments and excess weight started to disappear. My long-standing acne went away within a few months of dropping dairy. Her and her boyfriend now operate CandidChef.com, which has a bunch of recipes I'll link below. But I had to really look at this several times because the picture of the woman that I found, who was named Victoria on this website, did not look like she could even be the same person as that first picture. The first one is like, it's Aunt Vicky on the cruise, you know. Then all of a sudden she's like 20 years younger in a later picture. Uh, it's the same person though, pretty amazing. The power of plants. Okay, number three. Another couple who lost nearly 300 pounds, which is a mind boggling amount of weight. Yes, these three have all been from Forks Over Knives. We'll get to some unique ones that you definitely haven't seen in a little bit, but super thanks to them for compiling these. But they went from high cholesterol, high blood pressure, acid reflux, being afraid if they can fit in a chair or not, down to a healthy weight. And they said, quote, today our lab results and blood pressure numbers are fantastic and our doctors are impressed with all the healthy lifestyle changes we have made. Now, obviously I'm putting forth anecdotes, so I just have to quickly mention that population studies such as this one show that vegans on average have a normal BMI, unlike any other dietary group that those studies looked at. Now, number four is Lissa, possibly Lisa with two S's, of raw food romance. She went on a vegan, obviously raw diet and lost about 70 pounds. Now, a lot of people think that I hate raw vegan diets, even though my first real video on the topic says that it's probably the best way to instantly remove all processed foods. But if you're going the safe route and taking B12 like the doctors recommend and not denying that you need to, and you're getting enough calories since raw food is not as calorie dense, then you're good in my book. All right, back to Lissa. I feel weird how it's like, let's look at her butt, but this before and after picture is pure proof that you can get rid of cellulite. You can reverse that, which is pretty inspirational. The main reason though that I wanted to show her is this before and after picture of her face and other pictures of her face now. And you can really see how her inflammation disappeared, which is right in line with the studies like this one showing that when you put people on a vegan diet, their inflammation markers, their C-reactive protein drops by about 30%, which is pretty amazing. And of course you can follow her on Instagram and all that jazz, but now let's move on to number five. You may be familiar with Rich Roll. Now I always have to say that he went from dad bod to rad bod, but it's so much more than that. I was not aware that he was an alcoholic. He then got over that, went on a vegan diet, lost 50 pounds and apparently 10 years of age and also became a triathlete. Pretty incredible turnaround. When I was 39 years old, on the cusp of turning 40, I was 50 pounds overweight. I had been an athlete in college, but that was very much in my rear view mirror. It was in my past. I was a junk food addict, I was not taking care of myself. And I had a health scare shortly before my 40th birthday. I decided to change my life. I found vitality through a plant-based diet. It really restored my physical body back to health and wellness. You're probably aware of his podcast, which is available on iTunes and I will link below, but I would also suggest watching some of the videos that he's put out recently, such as the one where he interviewed two plant-based neurologists on brain degeneration, Alzheimer's and things like that. And there's some really good information in there. Okay, let's move on to the next one, number six. 
Jahina Malik, and I'm just gonna leave her before a picture for a second because I wanna mention that this is a unique one in the sense that she was born vegan. So in that picture, she is vegan, she looks good, but then she became a vegan bodybuilder. Now here she is as a professional bodybuilder looking super ripped at competition and all of that muscle was built with plants. So it goes to show that there are really no excuses left. There are none left. Now to the next one, number seven, who is my friend Aaron Shout. And before I show pictures, I wanna mention a few times I've talked about my friend who has cured her anemia on a vegan diet. She had very bad anemia for a very long time and went vegan and got rid of it. And so here is her before picture. And here she is now. Yeah, it's not a giant weight loss story, but she just looks so much healthier. She even discovered that she was able to tan, which she didn't know. But this really flies in the face of anybody claiming that they're not gonna get enough iron if they go vegan. So no, it's not just about losing weight and being skinny and blah, blah, blah. It's about being healthy and at a healthy weight that doesn't put you at an increased risk of disease like being obese does. And in this case, it's the opposite. It's being underweight for number eight, L. Taylor. So she was hospitalized for anorexia and then when going vegan, she was able to change her relationship with food and recover. And this makes sense to me because animal products are very obesogenic in nature. It's very easy to lose control of your weight when eating them, but shifting to whole plant foods where you can eat all of this fiber rich food that tells you when you're full and has all these nutrients, just a completely different mindset. She has a video with, I believe around 11 million views showing her transformation. You can check that out in the description below. All right, now number nine, Nimai Delgado. I'll just mention him quickly because I've mentioned him quite a few times. He was raised vegetarian, so that's vegetarian on the left. And then on the right, he is a vegan and he's a professional bodybuilder, super jacked, super ripped. And this just makes the same point as Jihina Malik, of gaining muscle on a vegan diet. Just showing that dudes can do it too. On a vegetarian diet since birth, so I've never consumed any kind of uh, fish, any kind of chicken, any kind of beef. A couple years ago, I decided to convert to an all plant-based diet. And at that same time, I decided to uh, compete in competitive bodybuilding. And only after you turned vegan, that's when you saw the most amount of gains, right? Yes. Yeah, so the, basically 90% of your gains came from a vegan diet. Yeah, exactly. And yes, he is a pro by the standards of the International Federation of Bodybuilding. And I will link his stuff below. And now for the last one, number 10, this guy who lost 150 pounds and claims to have been a Chinese buffet away from a heart attack. He says, quote, on March 1st of 2012, I was 44 years old, weighed 380 pounds, and was on blood pressure and cholesterol medicine. And then after going vegan, he says, quote, I recently went for a blood test and my numbers are now better than when I was on medicine. Before, just walking up a flight of stairs at work was a struggle. Now I love to run. I started signing up for races and a year and a half after starting at 380 pounds, I ran my first marathon. This is not just a good example of how weight loss and overall health go hand in hand, but also of how when you start feeling better, you can actually exercise and you get a synergistic effect because no one at 380 pounds wants to run a marathon. Or if you're having trouble walking upstairs, you aren't even gonna wanna walk. And let's add a bonus before and after, an unofficial one because it's completely internal. It is an angiogram from Dr. Esselstyn's study of putting people on a whole food vegan diet who had advanced cardiovascular disease. On the left is an inoperable clogged heart artery. And on the right is after a vegan diet, the same artery totally cleared, pretty cool. And that's all for the list. I guess this is the point where I should say I do have a recipe book. If you haven't bought it already, check it out. It will be linked below. But this is a great way to be inspired through the midpoint of Veganuary if you are doing Veganuary. And if any of these stories particularly resonated with you, look in the description below and you can learn more about the person's transformation. And thank you for watching. Feel free to like and subscribe and I will see you in the next video. And I'm living proof that you know you can build quality muscle mass in a short amount of time, uh, naturally, the key thing there, naturally, yeah. on an all plant-based diet. It didn't happen overnight. It wasn't easy, it wasn't linear. But ultimately, I found vitality through a plant-based diet. It really restored my physical body.